What's up you guys, I'm going to you with another video today And we're today doing 6 Samurai vs Cyber Dragons Now, I'm playing Cyber Dragons and my brother is playing 6 Samurais I haven't played Cyber Dragons for quite a while So, you know, excuse if I do some misplays here and there But we're doing a best out of 3 So expect game 2 coming up relatively soon And game 3 coming up soon So, keep on, like and subscribe if you like live duels and things like that I will start doing that constantly with friends and But most of the time it's just my brother and me just us just trying different decks but for the most part, we roll and he wins the die roll. And he starts off by activating Upstart Goblin, giving me a thousand life points. So the life point count will be like down there in the video. So you know, so you guys can keep updated on who's doing what damage. And you know, I'm just doing this commentary so you guys can kind of see like where you know where we do damage, things like that, and just some of the combos that the decks can do. But for the most part, he starts off with Gateway, and he plays the two cards he added off the She and Smoke signal. Kageki and the Kagamusha instantly putting Gateway up to four counters, which is absolutely crazy. Special summons Kizan and puts Gateway at six counters. And here's where Gateway, I kind of don't like it because the deck just can spam like crazy. So this surprised me. He actually goes into Link 2 and he makes Mrs. Radiant, activates Monster Reborn. Now Gateway has eight counters. He makes Sheehan. Uh, then I believe he removes four counters to add a... Oh, no, he... he yeah, it removes and adds... Removes four counters to add a six samurai, and then he special summons uh, the... Oh, no, no, he has ten counters, removes four, now he has six, special summons a Kageki, and now again he has eight. And I believe he passes turn to me, so I start off by <laughs> doing my favorite one-card thing, which is just kaijuing something, and he's asking if... We could, you know, if he can switch something else, but then activate Foolish Burial. Uh, send Cyber Dragon Core, banish Cyber Dragon Core to special summon a Cyber Dragon since he does control monsters. So from there on out, I'm um, just, okay, thinking, you know, I have Galaxy Soldier in hand, I have Instant Fusion in hand. What could I do? I'm surprised he really didn't overextend with his plays, but I start off by activating Upstar Goblin. So we're both at 9,000, we're both even Steven. And at this point, you know, uh, what did I do again? I think I special summoned the Galaxy Soldier. That would have been the right thing to do by pitching a Cyber Dragon. Since if we can't go into a Cyber Dragon play, we can bring back Cyber Dragon from the graveyard with Nova's effect. But for the most part, I get my second Galaxy Soldier search. If you guys can see, like getting rid of that Sheen was wasn't necessarily like a must, but it, it definitely helps in case I wanted to go instant fusion. Well, I actually did. Uh, being able to do that foolish barrel first actually got everything started. So remember, getting rid of like problematic boss monsters with kaiju is always the first thing to do. But then I normal summon Cyber Dragon Dry, activate his effect, make him a level 5, go into an XZ's play. Obviously, we want to go into Cyber Dragon Nova. I detach one, I detach Dry to get my Cyber Dragon to the from my graveyard, special summon him. And then I instantly slap on an infinity. And at this point, you know, we are we look we, we look pretty damn good. We take that kaiju with Cyber Dragon Infinity being such a good boss monster. I just wish we had another boss monster with the Cyber Dragon name. But for the most part, uh, I attack into Mrs. Radiant with Cyber Dragon. He takes a little bit of damage there. Then I attack again with the other Cyber Dragon. So at this point, he's at 8,500 with those two attacks. Then I attack with 2,700 with, uh, with Infinity. So leaving my 58, I'm at 9,000. At this point, we're pretty good. We have two pretty big bodies on the field and Cyber Dragon Infinity. But for the most part, he normal summons Fuma and special summons two Kagekis. And again, I lose count. I lose track of the gateway counters. It's insane. Even like watching the video and trying to do like the math of how much he has, I lost count. But the point is, he always uses the die. But as soon as he attempts to activate one of the effects of gateway, I instantly negate it. We we don't want any of that with Cyber Dragon Infinity. We don't want to deal with it. But so I detach the the Nova just in case you know I, I can bring it back with one of my other Novas, because you can, you can special summon a Cyber Dragon from the grave. But for the most part, he goes into a XZ's play, and instantly makes the Utopia the Lightning. That dude is just insanely good, because no cards can be activated when he declares an attack. And he beats over Eater of Millions, which is something I found out this weekend, but for the most part, he just runs over, he just trucks my damn Cyber Dragon Infinity, doing 2,500 damage. Then he attacks with, I don't know why he does this, but he always attacks with Fuma to get that special summon. So he attacks into my into my cyber dragon fuma destroys herself and her effect activates uh special summoning a uh, kizaru and kizaru when he special summon adds any six samurai card i mean I, I guess it's good because it gives protection to kizaru because she's in the in the graveyard now and, and with kizaru you could add a the the one that banishes two to special summon i forget her name the water one 
and I guess you could extend like that, but for the most part, you know, I guess he, he was just desperate for cards in hand. But yeah, so he gets rid of my Cyber Dragon Infinity. But what do I do here? I activate Instant Fusion and pay a thousand life points. And I just love Instant Fusion with this deck because you can go Panzer Dragon to make an Infinity. But for, I'm right here being a D-Bag and playing uh, Thousand Eyes Restrict. So with Thousand Eyes Restrict, I take instantly that Kizaru, uh, equip it to Thousand Eyes Restrict, and then I link one. I am so happy I got this card. You guys know what I'm talking about. It is Link Karibo, bro. That that, that thing is so good with Magic Muscles. I play with Cyber Dragon. And then I double Contact Fuse for Chimera Tech Mega Fleet Dragon, which is uh, not really what I wanted for this Legendary Dragon deck, but... It's pretty cool, but for the most part, I take the W by attacking with 36 and 21.